Welcome back to my channel, welcome back to another video. So this video is actually going to be the graduation vlog. I literally can't believe it. It's been so long coming. It's literally been over a year since I graduated from the University of Nottingham in psychology and I feel like I wasn't excited till today and now I'm like, it does feel quite exciting. So yeah, I thought I would document it on my channel because I just love having like these little memories on my channel forever but it's just so nice to look back on. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd just start the vlog here. I'm about to get ready. I'm just about to put these little eye patches on just because I don't know if they're going to do anything but why not? I feel like it makes me feel like I'm more prepared so I'm going to do that. I've already washed and dried my hair. I've already tanned so yeah it's just outfit to go really and makeup and hair. Oh yeah quite a lot to go but yeah I thought I'd start the vlog here. If you're new here I'd love you to stick around and subscribe and let's just go on with the graduation vlog. Let's put these on and I'll show you my hair and makeup and everything like that when I'm ready. I've also bought Bailey a little graduation cap, my little puppy and he is so cute in it. Okay, there we go. These look ridiculous, but they're on. My progress is, the makeup is now done. I'm happy with the makeup. I just kept it pretty normal, like I do every single day, because I didn't want to do anything crazy today, of all days, not the right day. Um, I've used these lashes, which are the Idol Whispers. I actually got them from TK Maxx, they're four pounds. And I absolutely love them. I used to use Demi Whispers when I first ever wore lashes. And I feel like these ones are like, a bit more but not too much so that is makeup done i'm not gonna do the hair i'm gonna curl it with the molly may um just the classic curl kit and then i'll report back with the hair i'm just mid curling my hair by the way i just want to put you on to the osmo purple shampoo any blondes like i used it this morning and it's literally took all the brass out of my hair like i haven't had my hair in that long ago to be fair maybe like a month ago but it was like already looking a bit yellowy which I feel like blondes just do, like after your toner washes out it pretty much doesn't look perfect but this toner is incredible and because my hair is naturally like I just have highlights but my hair is naturally very fair I only put it in for a minute because if I lift it any longer it would just be like white but this is literally a minute of that and I love the colour and if you have like a bit darker blonde if you have like a bronze kind of hair you can just put it in for a bit longer like just judge it, I'd say it's very strong but it's the Osmo that picture on screen not an ad or anything, my hairdresser told me about it and I went to buy it and it's incredible okay so i'm finally ready the makeup is always the same i already showed you the makeup this is the hair i've gone for like a i mean my classic just curly hair um earrings i've gone for like one little pearl one and then one little like sparkly hoop the sparkly hoop is from majori and the little pearl one i think i've been from primark i'm not really sure um but this is my dress a little moment for the dress i feel like you can't really see let me try and put you down I literally love the dress from Motel Rocks. It's got like a little split here. We've just got some photos. I'm going to show you the flowers and then we're going to go. Okay, a moment for the flowers. These are just, they're just so beautiful. These are the flowers. Move Bailey's treats out of the way. But yeah, these are the flowers. They're literally so pretty. They've got hydrangeas in them. So I'm having my Blair Waldorf moment. Um, but yeah, they're literally so beautiful. A little card in there. Bailey's just watching us because he's not coming. And he's like, don't go without me. Bailey! <gasps> Bailey! You got your graduation cap on! Okay, thought I would 
do a little update. We've done the whole walk across. Dad apparently filmed it, so fingers crossed that's a good video and you would have seen it just before this, but there's music playing, everyone's just getting their photos. And um, we had professional photos earlier, I think I already told you, but now we're just getting like one throw in the cup. I'm not a very good capture, so I might need to do that one again because I feel like people were waiting. And I got scared and I just did like a bit of a rubbish one, but I'm gonna try and do that again. I'm gonna get some clips for you now on my camera. Um, but yeah, that is how the day is going so far. So catch it, ready? Yeah, go on. Woo! Yes! Go on then. <laughs> That's never gonna fit on your head. <laughs> it is, it's quite big. Let me do that. Wait, wait. We've got another graduate. <laughs> Part two. Go on then, see how high you can throw it and catch it. I'm not sure everyone usually tries on the cab. Wow. Thank what you. degree did you do? Thank you. Um, I'm not sure, but it was really good. Uh, yeah. yeah I'm Highly friend. qualified. <laughs> okay, my, here's my catching. <laughs> well, first time. Mm. Hello. <laughs> there's, there's not really much to say, to be honest, but. Yeah. Super proud parents. Sorry, a bit cringe. And you told me not to whoop, but I did. I didn't think it was you because then someone on stage whooped for me. I thought, oh, they feel bad for her. No one's <laughs> cheered for her. No, I did. I, I thought I was quite scared you might do your wolf whistle. Uh, mm. They're like, because you can do a really loud whistle, can't I you? I can, yeah. But no, Dad told me not to. So we are just going back to the car. I just saw my dissertation supervisor, which was really, really cute. She was so nice. Um, she was just so nice. It was actually nice to see her in person because. I haven't actually seen her in person at all. Like our whole dissertations were just online. Um, sorry, the lighting's a little bit crazy. Um, but yeah, that is the end of the graduation. I'm gonna carry on vlogging the rest of the day because it's still celebrations. We're gonna go and pick up Bailey, which is so exciting because I miss him even though it's only a day. But I'm gonna give you a little tour of the campus. Well, a mini one, just the bit we're walking through because I thought, why not? I mean, we're never gonna come here again, probably unless I decide to do some extra post-grad after my master's, which isn't gonna happen, I can tell you that right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll, sh I'll show you like around here because in a minute is my first year student accommodation. And it's just crazy to look at because like, I didn't do YouTube when I was in first year uni, so none of these memories are on YouTube. So it's nice just to show you a little bit of it, but yeah. A little outfit of the day of mum's outfit. She Are you wore, <laughs> no, it's beautiful. She wore a beautiful white suit. Thank you. Nice little I sandals. It was beautiful until I saw a picture of me, and then I didn't think it was quite so beautiful. No, but that's okay because it can just be a bad photo. Okay, fine. fine. That's what I say. Yeah. You can just see our shadows. Yeah. Uh, so yeah. my um, suit is from Hobbs. <laughs> In case anyone wanted to pick up the suit, then it's from Hobbs. Um, but yeah, this is Rutland Hall. This is not where I stayed. I'm pretty sure this is Rutland. Yeah. Can't guarantee. But this is not where I stayed. You I stayed, stayed like Lincoln, Lincoln, which is all the way over the hills. You know what rem this reminds me of? The day when we drop you off. Yeah, because you like park the car, drop all, all your stuff off. On these fields. And then we had to just literally go all the stuff in. Yeah, one box after box. It's yeah. crazy to think. It was very hard work and it was raining. It's not that hall, is it? No, that's not mine. No. I'm getting disoriented. Mine is all the way over the hill because I remember it was a long walk to the gym. Yeah. May as well not bother going to the gym after you've walked this far. Is that why you didn't go? Yeah. <laughs> I did go sometimes. Yeah. I've just Are you regretting nearly wearing fallen over. Heels now, Georgia? Well, mum did tell me to bring some flat shoes so that I could swap. And I was like, that's so silly. Like, no one would do that. Like, it's going to look silly. And so many girls have bought their flats. Oh, the lighting's going a bit crazy. Basically, I've been very jealous of all those girls with the flat, with the flat shoe option. Is that Lincoln Hall behind that big bush thing? <laughs> One last glimpse. <gasps> Bailey! Hi! Hi, Paul! Hi, Paul! Hi! Did you miss us? Hello! Hi! Have you missed us, good boy? Have you missed us? Come on then. I thought I would just give you a little 
overview of the dress before it comes off. It's just plain at the back. It's really cute. And then at the front, it's just got this little one strap along the neck. And then it's just like loose fit it. But yeah, I've really enjoyed this dress. I would definitely recommend. I think it was like 36 ish pound which is so good from motel rocks and a lot of the dresses we looked at like this were so expensive so i definitely recommend this i also tried on like a creamy one which was really nice from motel rocks but i went for blue because blue is like nottingham's color so i thought it would match um someone asked me there like did you mean to match your dress i was like yeah i meant to it was purposeful um but we're gonna get changed now i thought i would just lastly give you a last one last look at the dress this slit did rise though when i was walking across the stage i was like oh my god is this slit gonna bite be too high but it was fine okay back into a comfy outfit i've just got this little top on from zara as always jeans shock zara um but yeah we're gonna go to the pub now and then we're gonna have italian takeaway which I'm so excited it's gonna be a cheat day because right now i'm being really healthy for my holiday well not for my holiday just in general but today it's a day off so i'm very excited for that be able to eat the pub with me i don't know if i showed you my graduation nails but these are them. Okay, we have just got back from the pub. I feel like this three gins has actually hit me hard. I don't know why, but it has. Um, back now, we've ordered a Chinese and I'm so happy. My Chinese order, lemon chicken is a must. Like literally lemon chicken, if you haven't tried it from the Chinese, it's incredible. And I'm also gonna have a quarter duck. This was the little card. Honestly, so cute. Okay, so it's now the next day, morning. I hardly vlogged this morning. We're now actually back from my grandma's. We stopped at the cutest little cafe on the way home. So I wanted to show you that. Um, I'll insert those clips now. Gonna probably a little time lapse because it was so busy there and I felt scared of my camera. So we're just taking our drinks with us because we're gonna get back on the road. Cheers. Yeah. How cute, apple tree tea house. Um, yeah, I've gone for a hot mocha. It's so nice, isn't it, this mocha? Yeah, it's beautiful. It's really creamy. Delicious. What have you gone for, Mum? Um, what do I always go for? A nice latte. Ice vanilla latte, yeah. classic. It's very cute, I definitely recommend. But, yeah, that was the little cafe we went to. We had a mocha. My mocha was literally incredible. I've also brought half it back and I'm going to make an iced mocha out of it because we all know my addiction with iced coffees. It's very real. Um, also had a coffee cake and asked my mum, like, honestly, I've been craving a coffee cake for about two weeks. I think since I've been on this, like, severe health kick, I've just really fancied, like, coffee cake. So we had that. We've now got home. I'm just going to put my flowers in a proper vase because they're so precious. And the little thing also came with some flower food. So I'm going to show you where the flowers are from, first of all. Um, put some flower food in there. I think me and mum are actually going to go shopping for work outfits this afternoon. Okay, so this is the little place they're from, Lockwoods of Tickle. Um, and there's an email there. So screenshot if you want to order. I'm not sure how far they deliver, but they're literally beautiful. Um, and I've put them all in this little arrangement by the fireplace i'm still not over them like i'm literally still not over them sorry to anyone who isn't obsessed with flowers but if you are i'm sure you can appreciate like how incredible these are they're just nothing like anything i've ever seen i love them and again the hydrangea is just incredible um bailey seems to be going a bit crazy over there what are you doing puppy what are you doing pup also anyone else's dog obsessed with ice cubes and everyone make an iced coffee he just, he's such a good boy, he just knows, he has to sit for it, and then he runs off with it. Take it. It's for you. Oh, he's going to eat it right there today. He's such a cutie. 